In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, amen. Mary, Mother of Jesus, throw your mantle of purity over our priests. Protect them, guide them, and keep them in your heart. Be a mother to them, especially in times of discouragement and loneliness. Love them and keep them belonging completely to Jesus. Like Jesus, they too are your sons, so keep their hearts pure and virginal. Keep their minds filled with Jesus and put Jesus always on their lips so that he is the one they offer to sinners and to all they meet. Mary, mother of Jesus, be their mother, loving them and bringing them joy. Take special care of sick and dying priests and the ones most tempted. Remember how they spent their youth and old age, their entire lives serving and giving all to Jesus. Mary, bless them and keep a special place for them in your heart. Give them a piece of your heart, so beautiful and pure and immaculate, so full of love and humility, so that they too can grow in the likeness of Christ. Dear Mary, make them humble like you and holy like Jesus. Amen. Praise be to Jesus. Hi everyone, Charles back with you here on a Friday. Well, here is the number one viewed life site story on their website for 2019. Pope Francis, it's better to be atheist than attend daily mass as a hypocrite. During a general audience at the Vatican in January, Pope Francis condemned Catholics who go to church every day, but go on hating their fellow men. He said it is better that they not go. How many times have we witnessed the scandal of those who go to church and spend all day there or attend every day and later go on hating other others or speaking ill of people. It would be better to not go to church. Live like a live like an atheist. Pope Francis has been unstintingly in his unstinting in his criticisms of some Catholics throughout his papacy, particularly conservative and traditional minded ones who attend the Latin Mass. Well, there it is, their, their biggest story. It has um, 450,233 uh, page views. All right, we'll talk to you again soon. Bye.